Hello, my name is John Thuma. Today we're going to cover how to use Tableau with Aster and Aster Express. The same exact uh, instructions will work against an Aster Express environment as it would a normal Aster environment. So let's go ahead and get going here. So this is what you're looking at here is a scatter diagram built in Tableau against an Aster data source that we developed for our K-Means video not too long ago. And as you can see here, I can actually look at the different cluster IDs. Um, this is cluster one, this is cluster zero, um, and then this is cluster two up here for the different types of uh, measures here. So we have retail price over horsepower, length, and weight. So to do that, what we do is we come here to file and new, and uh, we'll go ahead and bring that up over here. And the first thing we'll do is we'll connect to a data source. And what you're doing here is you're actually connecting to the Aster Queen. So let's go ahead and put in the information 192 of our, what we're doing is putting the IP address here of our Queen. So for Aster Express, that's 192.168.100.100. The name of the database is Beehive. The username is DB Super User. Of course, that's same password as DB Super User. Then we're going to connect connect here. And what this is now doing is actually making a connection to our Aster environment. And then we will go through and we will map out the data source and start to construct our query. So here we go. So we're in the Beehive database. It's on server, the Aster Queen. And then here's the database. And we're going to choose a public schema. This is where all the data is housed for that chart that we just showed you earlier. So this is going to bring up a list of data objects and then one we're going to choose is this k-means result right here. We'll double click on that particular object and then we'll go to the worksheet. And now we're in the Tableau infrastructure. So the first thing we're going to do is we'll put the cluster ID in here. And this will post back and query back so you may want to turn things off and on and things like that as you see fit. I'll put the car name in there too. And then I'm going to put my measures inside of the actual system. Here, put retail price in the rows, and we'll put horsepower on the top. And as you can see, it's already started to come up. We'll choose the scatter flow diagram here, and we'll start to put in other measures that, uh, let's put that down here like so, that up here. And then we'll put other measures like that. So you can see here, now we're starting to look like our scatter diagram that we just created inside of our, at, at the beginning of our subsequent video. So that concludes our video, how to um, attach Tableau to Aster and Aster Express. This is also covered inside of the new documentation that will be coming out soon on how to do this. So basically it follows through and tells you how to go through all of the steps in constructing your um, Aster Express Tableau report and then um, also the video that generated the k-means output. So thank you very much and I hope you're having a great day. Bye-bye.